what street are we on here? So he's dropping us off. How are you feeling now, Tate? Nervous, but I'm like, I'm really excited. I'm very, I'm feeling very confident. Mm -hmm. Good. Um, yeah. So, I'm going through it right now. Thank you. Thank you. Showtime. So excited to interview Kane. Okay, I'm probably going to sit there. He's going to sit there. Oh, is this what he's going to be wearing tonight? He's going to look fresh in a mirror. Love the sparkles. Okay, I'm so excited, but nervous at the same time. Got a little butterflies in my stomach. But I got this. You got the feet, right? Okay, perfect. Today I am here with country legend, soon father of three, and recently gone diamond, the amazing Kane Brown. How are you? I'm good. How are you feeling today? I feel good. This is the third show of the tour. I had some hiccups last night, so hopefully we can fix them tonight and just have you know 100% show. I think you're going to do amazing, and thank you so much for sitting down with me and spending this special time with me. And let's just remind everyone, this is an exclusive behind the scenes of the In The Air Tour. So let's talk. Can you tell us the story behind your look? Yeah, so um, have you ever heard of Amiri? Yes. So Mike Amiri has been um, dressing my whole tour. So. Oh, wow. Um, had another malfunction last night, so only... I think I wore his pants, that's about it. But tonight, it's all a mirror. Ooh, I'm loving your outfit. And Thank my you. side of the story is that I'm wearing my Air Max DNs. I want to be walking on air to be at the Indie Air Tour. That's amazing. So can you tell me, how does someone feel when before hitting the stage? Like, because I really don't know what it feels like. Uh, for me, it's um, just a lot of energy and excitement and... I just want to go out there and give it my all for the fans that spent their money to come and see me. You know, you never know if it was their first time or not. Yeah. Um, so it's always just, it's very exciting. Yeah. It, do you feel nervous sometimes? Um, not really. I used to. Uh, not as much anymore. But I will say there's still some butterflies here and there. Yeah. I could get some butterflies sometimes too yeah. when interviewing before my interviews. But I, I get super excited. I get pumped. I feel like music helps me get into my mode. Who are you listening to? You. You don't have I, to lie. No, no, I do. I oh, do. Thank you. I listen to you. I listen to Taylor Swift. Hey. I really love Taylor Swift. Um, so yeah, I think music helps me get into my mode. So can you describe your in the air tour in three words? In three words. Um, very big energy. Like I'm that. not very good at getting put on the spot. <laughs> I would have thought of something different. <laughs> it's okay. I'm loving your shoes. Oh, are those Amiri? Amiri as well, yeah. I'm loving that you're putting, that you're wearing all Amiri today. Well, thank you. It's honestly probably my favorite brand. I love how much in the fashion you are. Oh, thank you. What would you say to 10-year-old Kane at this very moment in your life, hours before hitting the stage? Is 10-year-old Kane going on stage? <laughs> or is ten is ten year old Kane talking to me? Yeah. That is a hard question. I do not remember being ten. I would tell my baby self just to keep going, you know, and stay strong and always believe in yourself. Yes, and don't give up. Never, Never give, give up. up. Yes, Never give up. Always keep trying until you get it. Yes, ma'am. Never give up. So what is something that you have to do right before going on like going on stage? Well, I usually jam out to music in here with my band and um, friends or whoever we have in town. Um, and we just, you know, get loose and, and listen to music. So that calms you? Like music helps you get into the mode or? It doesn't really calm me. It actually helps. It pumps me up more. It gets me out there. It's almost like I can put a show on in here and then take that energy out to the big stage. Yeah, that's, that's me too. I, like I got to get pumped up with music, start dancing everywhere. <sighs> Yeah. <laughs> what are your top three songs from your catalog? From my catalog? Yes. <clears throat> um, well, we know Heaven Just Went Diamond. Yes. Um, my song What Ifs uh, should be going diamond pretty soon. 
Ooh. And then I would probably have to say thank God was my wife because it's been out the least amount of time um, than my other songs have. They're like, like I have a song that's five times platinum and maybe six times platinum, but thank God's four times platinum, and it's only been out for a year. So that one's going to catch the other ones. Okay. I love that song, too. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I love that family is so big to you, and I love the caps that you wear that say family on it, and I definitely need to get one of those. So let's talk Kingsley and Cody, and I love Kingsley's laugh. It's so cute. <laughs> like, it makes me laugh, like, when I see her laugh. It just makes me laugh. It's so cute. So that brings me to my question. What is Kingsley grabbing from Mom's closet? Oh, she's grabbing her big sparkly heels that <laughs> they come up to her thigh, basically. <laughs> and then um, she always grabs her purses from the closet, always her glasses, her jewelry. She loves her jewelry. Uh, so we usually have to give her a little bit cheaper jewelry in case she loses it. <laughs> and uh, Cody, my youngest one, uh, follows right after. Her. And she, when she sees her big sister walking in heels, she's got to walk in heels as well. Oh, I love that, that they just want to yeah, be the same. Yeah, they're best friends. Oh, I love that. I have a sister, too, and we're best friends. Nice. Well, always keep them close. Because yes. me being older, me and my brothers and sisters, we've kind of split up, so just make sure you always stay tight. Yeah, we're like this. We're be Our friendship is so big, That's and awesome. we're all together. My favorite category, let's talk fashion. Okay. What is your wardrobe checklist looking like for In The Air tour this year? So I didn't have a checklist at first, and so this is my first tour where I've actually had um, someone dressing me. Ooh! So like today I got here and this was here, which was really cool. And then I have stuff on the rack that I got here and that was here today. It's also a Miri. My first show, they sent some things. Not all of it fit me, so I, luckily I found one outfit out of the everything they sent me that I got to wear. Um, this will hold me over for today. And, and maybe two others or three? Three um, more shows? I don't know. It, sometimes they'll ask for it back before I get to wear it. And then they'll <laughs> send me other stuff. So. Well, that stuff looks good. Like I'm excited. I, lo I love that it all matches. You know, yes. You got the top and the bottom pieces. Yeah, I so. like when s stuff match. Um, but today I kind of went for something different. This looks great because I love that that's like a you know a designer jacket and then the Nike like athletic it, you pull it off. Oh it thank you. Sick. But you look so dope by the way. Like, thank you. I so appreciate dope. that. We all know that you love basketball. Best dressed NBA player. Ooh that one's hard. That is a really hard question. Man. I know. I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with Damian Lillard. I just interviewed him. I just well, interviewed actually, I just Damian Lillard. That. I just saw that you just interviewed him, but I think he's one of the best dressed. He he has some swag. Yeah. I think when he walks down that tunnel, he got some swag. <laughs> I just want to say, it has, if no one has said it yet, happy seven-year engagement anniversary to you and Caitlin. Oh, thank you. And I do my research before sitting down with my guests, so happy anniversary. My very last question, who does Kane Brown think I should interview next? Who do I think you should interview next? Will we, okay, give me a topic, like, or not a topic, but a, um, like a athlete, like a checklist. music, It doesn't matter, actor. you could pick anything. Well, you like fashion too. Okay, yeah, I'll do that, we'll say Travis Kelsey. You, because you do also like Taylor Swift. Yeah, so. I actually interviewed him, but I do want an exclusive interview with him. I did okay. get a quick one, but uh, I definitely wanted it. I want to sit down and interview with him. So. Well, nice. Do you need another one? Yeah, I want to get a like a good one, get to know him a little well, better. I mean, do you need me to pick somebody else, or do you just want me to say Travis Kelsey? You, she she's gonna interview you. Oh, well, you could just tell him that, yeah, get, put in a good word in for me, Travis, please. Travis, she's interviewing you, man. I don't care. <laughs> I'll come find you myself. <laughs> don't hurt me. <laughs> Guys, you already know, dreams are meant to be lived. Kane Brown is living his music dreams, literally about to hit the stage, literally in minutes. Oh, my God. It's so good. Good job. Thank you. <laughs> I'm giving you all my confidence to you tonight. I need your confidence. 
You got this. We have a special toast, all right? Come on. Oh, 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 She's gonna kill it. This is our third show tonight. Yeah! Yes. And it's gonna be an amazing show. Yes, it is. He's gonna nail it. Yes. Oh. And he's gonna take over this whole place in this whole city. Yes. Right yes. now, today, yes. tonight, yes. and yes. Yes. Yes.